Hi, I'm Sarah with that hashtag show, and I'm here talking with Miss Taylor Parks. Hello, how are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Thank you. I'm so excited for people to get to see Spinning Gold and you in it. I remember you coming up in Hairspray, and now I feel like in a way, you're a little bit like Neil. You have written some of the biggest songs or some of the biggest people. You've done your own music, and it's your time. I feel like this is your time. (laughs) So talk to me a little bit about becoming Donna Summer and getting that call. Absolutely. Getting the call was a a shocker, first of all, because I didn't know anything about the project and also because I've taken a step away from on screen acting for for some time um, to focus on the music. But something about it, like just coming in, like when I read the script and when I saw that Evan Bogart is also a part of the story and when I met Tim, I was just like, it, something about it intrigued me. And then after reading the script and me even as a music fan learning more about these iconic artists, I was I was sold. Um, and so from then it started off on me being able to have the fun task of doing my research, which was starting at A and really going into finding some interviews, which there's not as many interviews as I thought that I would find. Yeah. Um, which was a little bit surprising. But, you know, she was an artist that a lot of people really resonated with the music and they missed all of these other things personally about her that made her incredible. Um, and so, yeah, like being able to learn that and also seeing that she was a singer songwriter, you know, those were all things that went into me putting together my portrayal of her. I love that. What was your favorite fun fact that you learned about LaDonna Summer? <laughs> well, my, my favorite fun fact was learning that they had released Love to Love You Baby before and it didn't do well. Um, and then they went back and did it again. And so that was something that was like inspiring, first of all, because it showed just how much she believed in her own self. Um, and how much Neil also believed in Cecil and, you know, all of these other people, um, which was beautiful to see. I love in the film that whole like sequence of them creating Donna mm-hmm. and talking about how she was nothing like that in real life. Um, was there a scene, whether one that you were in or elsewise or otherwise, that was your favorite that you saw? Hmm, I think my favorite was performing Dim All the Lights. Uh, and I think that that song has a special place to me because my mom used to play it. And also because it was her showing another side um, of of, uh, of herself and her vocal um, abilities, which, you know, was something beautiful. I don't know. It, it's something about that song. Um, so I think that that's my favorite scene. Yeah, I love this music because it's again, it's like my parents cleaning music. Like I heard it every yeah. morning and I'm like, oh, no, I got to do the bathroom today. Like that's yep. What's coming for me? Um, (laughs) (laughs) um, For those that are watching, we love to do this for social media. Give me like a quick 30 seconds of why everyone should watch this film. Everybody should watch this film because whether you were born in the 60s or whether you were born in the 2000s, there's something that you'll learn about these artists. I think that, you know, whether you grew up with them, there's something that you'll learn, like little facts. Um, And then also for the younger audiences viewing it, it, you really start to see some of your favorite artists that you see now. Um, how they evolved from those artists. And that's always kind of fun to see because you hear them talk, you hear our favorite artists now talk about these incredible singers and songwriters and to be able to learn more about their history um, really just makes you even more connected to the music. I think any music fan, even if you're not a music fan and you're just a fan of films that are about perseverance, that's what this story is. Perfect. And thank you so much. That's my time. And I hope everyone goes out to check out Spinning Gold. Thank you.